minus 20. Falcon 9 is configured for flight. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, Just over T plus one minute into flight, we're hearing nominal callouts. The Merlin engines have throttled down in preparation for passing through the period of maximum dynamic pressure. We have gold experiencing maximum aerodynamic pressure. A minute and a half into flight. We're through the period of maximum dynamic pressure. The Merlin engines are throttled back up to full power. Trajectory performance continue to look nominal. MVAC engine chill has begun. You hear the call out, MVAC chill has begun. Liquid oxygen Vehicle now on top of the turbo pump for the second stage engine, chilling it in as we prepare for stage separation and then ignition of the upper stage engine. Next major event coming up in less than 30 seconds is going to be main engine cutoff, shutdown of the nine Merlin engines, followed by stage separation and ignition of the second stage engine. T plus three minutes and 15 seconds into flight, a good stage separation, ignition of the upper stage engine, next event coming up in about 15 seconds, fairing separation. Thanks, up confirmed. T plus three minutes, 50 seconds into flight. You saw a good fairing separation. We heard confirmation over the countdown net. Second stage engine continues burning. This will go until about T plus eight minutes and 38 Second seconds, at trajectory. which time we would have shut down Bermuda in a parking orbit around the Earth. Second stage engine is on the first of two planned burns. As I said, the first one will put us in a parking orbit followed by a second burn about 27 minutes into flight that would put Inmarsat into a geostationary transfer orbit followed shortly afterwards by spacecraft separation. Performance continues to look nominal on the upper stage. 
Chamber pressures look good, engine looks good, trajectory looks good. T plus five minutes into the flight of Falcon 9 carrying Inmarsat 5 F4. Performance continues to be nominal. We're heard, heading currently east out of Complex 39A at Kennedy Space Center, heading for the first parking orbit, which will be followed by a second burn at about T plus 27 minutes into the transfer orbit. We'll be covering both burns and spacecraft separation during the webcast. T plus six minutes, performance continues to be nominal. About two and a half minutes left in this first burn of the upper stage engine. As a reminder, in webcasts in the past, we've also been watching first stage at this time. But in this case, without landing legs or grid fins, the first stage is not being targeted to return to land or the drone ship. So today, we're staying with the second stage all the way to orbit. Second stage continues to follow the nominal trajectory. T plus seven minutes in the flight. MVAC engine continues working. Everything continues to look good for Falcon 9 headed to the low earth parking orbit. First stage loss of signal expected. Start a terminal guidance. T plus eight minutes into flight. We're just over half a minute away from the planned shutdown of the MVAC D engine on the second stage. Trajectory looks nominal. Propulsion continues to look nominal. And when we get shut down, we'll wait and listen for the call from the guidance engineer letting us know how the orbit looks. We've had shutdown of the upper stage engine right on time. Trajectory looks good. It looks like we have a good parking orbit. So this completes the first of two burns of the second stage engine. Now we're currently going through a coast phase. Is the second stage with Inmarstat still attached? Coasts around the Earth, over Africa. We will reacquire telemetry and follow the second burn of the upper stage engine. That'll be at about T plus 27 minutes. So the plan right now is we'll continue the webcast, but we'll come back with status updates starting at T plus 26 minutes 
And in the meanwhile, we'll leave you with this view of the animation. The second stage heads towards Africa, successfully into the low Earth parking orbit, preparing for the second burn of the upper stage, coming up in just under 17 minutes and 10 seconds. So with that, that'll end our commentary. We'll be back at T plus 26 minutes.